Hey everybody, it's a Mad Master here. I'm doing one more video tonight, and uh, this one's about the whole controversy about what the media uh, I almost feel ashamed even talking about this. This is so fucking stupid. Oh, weird. Um, I thought I sh maybe I shaved here accidentally. Just <laughs> I could see like a line. Oh, well, it's like a. Uh, this whole notion of digital blackface, like the idea that sharing memes that have people of color in them is problematic because you're white and it's cultural appropriation. Blah, 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 blah. So this is what I think about it. It is fucking ludicrous and so stupid. And it's like, you know, they talk about horseshoe theory, right? You know, where the far right and far left get together. Bernie Sanders and Ron Paul, you know, wanting to impeach Bush for the war in, in Iraq or whatever. There's one thing to talk about that and we can go into, you know, I'm not going to go into that when I think about all that because I, you know, happen to have a lot of ideas that they kind of, they do get together, you know, they do, that horseshoe is definitely alive in me, I'll just say. But it's another thing to talk about the idea that something has gone so far around, it's starting to become what it was fighting against. And it's Nietzsche, you know, talked about it, you know, they gaze into the mirror or the pool, uh, you gaze back at you or whatever the quote is, you know, I'd have to pull it out. I haven't read that in years, but um, this whole notion that, you know, there's things you cannot do, you know, you cannot do this or that because uh, other, and uh, ostensibly what so-called race doesn't, you know, the, it's, it's theirs. It's, it's only theirs. It's like, I mean, I almost have expect them to say you have to, you know, I'm going to have to start drinking at my own separate water fountain the way that these things are going. It's fucking ludicrous. And I don't know if I'm going to put this up on, I'm, I'm putting, okay, so just a note, I'm going, I'm becoming more active on my Rumble channel. I'm probably going to be doing a lot more stuff with that. It's a lot better uh, quality than a certain other uh a certain other website, I think, as far as like alt, alt media, whatever, or new tech. Hi, everybody. It's a new tech exclusive where I talk about blowing Trump. No, I'm just making fun of six sex and hammer. Anyway, it's like, you know, <laughs> um, <laughs> I just like making fun of people sometimes. People like making fun of me, so whatever. Um, yeah, just this whole notion that. Like, there's certain things you can't share. I even saw, like, RuPaul, a RuPaul meme that people, like, they were talking, they were targeting this meme, like, you go girl, stuff like that. Like, like a, a white person can't post that. Like, what the fuck happened? What the fuck happened to these people? What what did you do? What what kind of rabbit hole did you, What what kind of drugs did you do to say that it's racist to like share a fucking meme it's just so ludicrous and you know it's like i think they've gone so far now they're digging up so much weird shit it's like they're they're gonna fall you know and very hard in this this it's just a joke it's become a joke you know it's become a joke and there'll be some brainwashed fools that will uh Fall, follow along, of course, because that's how things go. But I think people are beginning to see how stupid a lot of this stuff is. It's like, you know, like I said, it's like, first of all, like the whole term people of color, like pumping everybody that's different, you know, certain races in together. Like, I mean, famously said by certain commentators, actually someone I just mentioned, as, as an immigrant from Nambia, the same as someone that grew up in Chicago's South Side? Are they the same as someone that went, you know, grew up in Minneapolis? Are they the same as someone that uh, comes from it comes from uh, comes from Chile? Are all those people the same? But a lot of the left wants to collectivize this whole thing and make it this one big broad group of people. 
And I think that's very, very disingenuous and, you know, dare I say dangerous. I think it's stupid. So that's why I hate that term. Um, uh, I'm sorry that I, I'm sorry that I don't jump on the, the current thing. I like to call people what they are. If they want to be called what, what people want to be called, but not what some stuffy white professor fucking rich liberal wants to call them. Just like the whole Latinx thing, you know, or Latinx or whatever. It's like, just a lot of this stuff is so stupid. A lot of these new, mis you know, different labels and stuff. But I, that's not what this video is about. This is about this digital blackface thing. It's so, it's just fucking ludicrous. And I'm just like, I'm going to start sharing memes like that probably. It's just like, why is, why is that, you know, the thing is, uh, I'll just say that I'm just going to say this word. It's not, you know, I, I don't, I don't know what term I should use. African American community, community has contributed so much to our society and our culture that it's inseparable for a white person to separate anything that the black community owns from their, you know, from their cultural dialect. Because there's just so much. Like every style of music that you play is influenced by you know, blues in some way, unless you're playing pure classical or something. It's, it's just like very much, or maybe some forms of country and Western, you know, it's kind of, you know, you can weed out some of that with some, with some of it, but for the most part, it's very influenced by a lot of stuff. So you would have to just cut out everything to not appropriate the culture, you know, and I'm just wondering if some of these, I bought a book, book about CRT actually. And, uh, it's written as actually a pro CRT book because I wanted to read what the other side is saying. And if I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm going to predict that they, there's some subtle hints at what, and wanting segregation back in a, in a certain way and all this stuff. Cause there, I've, I've seen analysis of different CRT books and some of these commentators have read me verbatim, verbatim, excuse me, where they're saying this kind of stuff. So. That's some food for thought, for food for thought, because it's like, we're kind of, that's that circle, we're circling this, we're the drain, but you know, we're circling into this thing where it's kind of like the horseshoe theory. It's just like, they're getting to be, dare I say, racist, like what racists believed, what, you know, neo-Nazis or white separatists believed is a lot of what these people believe. And it's not even like a, the Black Panthers probably didn't even believe in some of this bullshit. They probably laugh at half the stuff that people are talking about for real, you know? So, and I know this is a very sensitive subject to talk about, but whatever, whatever. you know, it's, it's just such, so, it's just so stupid. And you know, this whole digital blackface, oh, I don't share a meme that has, that the you know, black people like to share. Oh, I'll share whatever the fuck that I want, you know? And you know, I would, I, I'm not going to be too violent in this video. I'll, I'll do that on my alt tech stuff, but you know, I would probably <laughs> print out a meme and, shove it up something, you know, of these, some of these article writers and just, I don't know. I, I, I talk about like, shoving things up people's rear ends a lot. And in fact, there's a short story I'm writing, but anyways, I, yeah, I, you'll see that pretty soon, but <laughs> that's all I'm going to say. That's about all.